We have all heard about solar energy, but what does it actually do, and can it benefit our lives in more personal ways? And tonight's Eye on Cal Land, Max Hofer is going to shed some light on how solar panels work in Sioux Falls. One look at this neighborhood, and you might not notice anything out of the ordinary. But at Patrick Hicks's home, there's more going on behind the scenes. From right now, I, the, our home is one of the very few. It's really the first in our neighborhood to have solar panels. The panels convert energy from the sun directly into Hicks's home. So we're really excited about that. But what made Hicks join that list of 12 people in Sioux Falls to have a solar powered home? My wife is uh, British, and uh, my mother in law back in Britain, she recently got remarried. And the guy she married actually won the Nobel Prize with Al Gore uh, for his work on climate change. So it seemed like a, a perfect convergence of all of these different things, and uh, we had them put on pretty quickly. The tech may appear complicated, but you don't need to be a whiz to have them built in. I knew nothing about solar technology at all, so it's been a pretty steep learning curve. Helping with the curve is Ron Disborough of Midwest Solar. There are many things to take into account when getting the panels installed. They start with an analysis of your electric bill and monthly use of your utilities. And we put together a system to provide the needs of the customer, whether it be cutting their electric bill in a quarter, in a half, um, if they want energy storage to take care of their entire load. The energy travels similarly to a power line. So the panels produce a DC energy, and then it goes down into an inverter, and the inverter takes it from a DC energy into an AC energy, and then we tie it right into the electrical panel in your basement. But only a part of Hicks's home runs off solar power. The other half is through XL Energy, a seamless union of solar and grid-based power. We haven't noticed any change at all, except obviously in our, our energy bill, which has gone down dramatically. But we can't tell when we're cycling on solar or when we're cycling off the grid. Taking in all that sun can sometimes cause there to be excess energy sitting in your home. Sometimes during the day, if no one's home, um, no lights are on, furnace isn't running, AC isn't running, you might be overproducing. Now, all of the extra energy that comes from the sun into Hicks's home doesn't stay exclusively to him. It actually gets sent back out to other places that need it. You have an agreement with Excel Energy, and they purchase that excess power, and uh, it goes onto their line and helps uh, power the houses around you. Something you wouldn't notice going on through your day, but if you would like to, there's an app for that. The app, it, it's, it's in real time, and it tells us how much energy the solar array is generating. It tells us how much the house is using, and it's also telling us how much energy we're giving back to the grid, um, i.e., how much money we're making by giving money back to the grid. In the first week Hicks's home was connected, he's prevented up to 144 pounds of CO2 emission, which is the equivalent of planting three and a half trees. Over time, these panels will eventually pay for themselves. You have to be really living in your house for, a, for a, an extended period of time, and my wife and I will be in this house for at least another 10 years. So, you know, it'll take us about eight years to sort of pay off the initial investment of the solar, and then um, after that, um, we'll just sort of, it'll be rolled into the total cost of the house. So we're really just paying it forward. Helping out Mother Earth to give his son a brighter future. Our son is, he's young, and, and he sees that we're taking climate change seriously. And we'll be able to look at him as an adult and our grandkids uh, in the eye, and we'll, we'll tell them, you know, we did something. With Eye on Kelloland, I'm Max Hofer. To get an estimate of how much it would be to install solar panels in your home, we have a link for you under this story at kelloland.com. NFL highlights are up next after this break.